Hello and good evening to everybody. This is Harry Reasoner, and welcome to Real Stories from Real People I've Met. It's your job tonight to guess which one of these following stories is not true. I talked to a lady in a bar once who uh, told me that she had had several past lives. Her most recent was as uh, Cleopatra. I went to school with a guy who told me that he had a close encounter with Sasquatch. I met a grown man once who was quite firm in his belief that, well, people used to live to be 900 years old and that there used to be giants. I worked with a guy for a little while who was uh, really quite pleased with the work of his chiropractor. He was so sure of the great effects of chiropractic that, well, he had gone once or twice a week every week for many many years a few months ago a lady i work with told me with a straight face that about once a month she watches tv for an hour or so with her dead grandmother i once uh, met a lady who told me that the earth was very young so evolution was false and uh, her proof was that well there was some guy in australia who managed to make oil in his composter and just a couple of months. I met someone once uh, who was really quite sure that Santa Claus is real. I once met a guy who was absolutely convinced that dodos weren't actually extinct. They had just chosen to become invisible so as to avoid extinction. I met a lady once uh, who believed that dinosaurs and humans uh, lived together. I met a guy in a bar once who said that there were no transitional forms in the fossil record. I've met a number of people who think that the future can be revealed by flipping tarot cards. I was talking to a guy in a bar once. He was uh, pretty sure that in amongst the crowd were vampires. And I asked him why he thought that and he told me that he had read a book that had discussed several documented cases of vampirism. And I said, uh, what does that mean, documented case? And he said, well, duh, they're, they're documented. I said, uh, well, that's not good enough. What, what do you mean, documented? And he said, well, there are documents. So I borrowed a pen from the bartender and grabbed a napkin. I wrote this out for him. And I gave it to him and I said, okay, fuckhead, I, you can believe in werewolves now, too. I used to meet for coffee with this guy who told me that uh, all radiometric dating techniques were false and that the Earth is uh, 6,000 years old. I met a lady once who uh, told me that there is no way that two Geminis should ever live together. And when I laughed... She told me that that was always the reaction of a Scorpio. I knew someone in university who believed that there was this guy named Noah once who got two of every animal from all around the world and put them in a big boat and so survived a big flood. I met a therapist once who uh, told me that bedwetting in children could be cured and treated by having the child walk outward spirals while performing certain hand movements. This would push the child more into their feet and it would cure bedwetting. I've met a whole bunch of people who've told me that there used to be this guy who when he wasn't walking on water he was turning it into wine and that he got killed to atone for a debt to his father who was really himself and I, it was something like that anyway.